Hello guys, I'm back with X-Men 112 to 116. Um, this cover is done by George Perez, uh, probably one of the better artists that don't get enough attention in my opinion, but uh, I will do a video another time about uh, George Perez. But uh, from what I understand, this is the first time that Wolverine was drawn with hair, hairs on his arms. So that's kind of a benchmark, uh, uh, a new thing. Uh, it's a great book. Uh, if you have never read the X-Men, this is a great book. I wish I have a raw copy to show you, but unfortunately I saw uh, the raw copy I had. But... Uh, the fight scenes where well, Magneto uh, used his uh, power to get Wolverine to almost uh, stab himself or slash himself with his claws. That's just fantastic. Um, this is a beautiful copy. Um, not much else to say, but uh, it's one of my favorite for sure. Next is um, 113. Uh, a shout out to uh, a YouTube uh, subscriber that uh, thought about buying a, a copy of this book, and here's my copy. Um, I wish I wish I still have a few uh, few other copies of this book because at one point I had uh, three raw copies that were just beautiful. I slapped them all, and uh, I sold them all. Uh, too bad I didn't uh, go on YouTube uh, earlier because I think I would have uh, be happy to uh, let another collector have a shot at the book raw if you want it. But here's my copy. Uh, it's beautifully center. Um, you know, it's one of these books that I bought a long time ago, and and uh, I was so happy to keep it in such great condition over the years. And uh, when I slab it, I got a nine eight. So. No. Can't, can't say anything else about it. It's a great issue. Um, beautiful cover. And then you have 115. This is a great cover um, by Byrne. And um, it's a beautiful book. You know, the, the wrapping is not perfect, but uh, you know, I, I can't complain. Um, Saw Run is awesome. Uh, I can say one thing, um, you know, Neil Adams can draw a beautiful Saw Run, but uh, Burn is pretty darn good. Um, let me show you. Um, what I'm talking about. Here's my 115. That's raw. Look at this splash page. It is simply beautiful. Where Sauron grab Storm's hair and drag her. Um, here is the beautiful page I'm talking about. It's a double page uh, drawn drawing. Just look at how beautiful Wolverine is. You can't get any better than that. Um, and then if you look at uh, Sauron, you really, um, I can stare at this page for a long, long, long time. And I have over the years, I must have reread that, uh, this copy over and over and over uh, because it's such beautifully drawn. Uh, oh, I skip uh, 114. So here's 114. It's a really, really nice cover. I. I really like the way uh, the, the the shadow was done. Uh, you know, Burnham is great. I mean, I I, I love Dave Cockrum, but uh, you know, once in a while when Burn did the cover, uh, it's just gorgeous. He have his own style, and uh, it's just magnificent. And um, here's one fourteen. So you have 115 and this is 114. I do not have a 116 in slabs. 
uh, I have a couple raw copy but for some reason over the years I just never um, slap my copy it is my absolutely favorite burn cover of the entire Bronx uh, run he did I think that's one reason why I never slab the book because I want to read it again and again and again uh, look at this uh, it's a gorgeous gorgeous cover with Colossus I mean the way he was burning turning red you know, I can't say enough about how much I love this copy. Uh, this issue is by far my favorite cover by Byrne. And this part, this copy probably is a nine six. As you can see, it have a few ding there on the spine, very minor, but the rest is gorgeous. The one problem with this issue is uh, for some reason during the production process I think the inking was not very dark I don't think it's Terry Austin's fault but uh, there's something going on with the inking process, printing process that I think make the, the um, drawing kind of light but here's again burned with his double page drawing this is gorgeous He can draw every character beautifully. Um, of course, with Terry Austin help, but uh, you know it's it's kind of weird. But as you can see, uh, you know all the panels of each page is kind of light. I really don't understand it, but uh, once again, great, great many pages of Wolverine. And let me see. This is perhaps my favorite, uh, I guess, page for this uh, comic book where Wolverine uh, met the dinosaur and how he took care of the dinosaur. Pretty neat. Uh, you know, if you have a chance to read the reprint or buy this issue, do it. It's great. I, I, um, you know. I know I'm a biased X-Men fan, but uh, you know it's hard for me to fathom a, a comic book fan that would not enjoy reading these books. Thanks for watching. Hopefully, I will come back with um, 117 through uh, 122 or so in the next video. Thanks.